Hi, this is Nolan from Benchmark, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to reset your Hemisphere S631. So it's always a good idea to do this every once in a while, just to make sure everything's working as best as it can. Um, but all I need to do this is a device that can choose a Wi-Fi signal. So whether that be an Android phone or an Apple phone, it doesn't really matter. Uh, in this case, I'm just going to be using a Windows 10 computer. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and choose a Wi-Fi signal in Windows 10 here. And when I do that, that's going to bring up my Wi-Fi options here. And you can see that I have a Wi-Fi signal that looks awfully similar to the serial numbers you can find on the bottom of your Hemisphere S631. And then I'm just going to hit connect here. And as that's connecting, I'm going to open up a web page here and I'm going to enter the following address 192.168.10.1. Oh, okay, whoops, uh, .10 .1. Uh, refresh the page and you can see that I have a uh, username and password that I'm prompted for. Uh, in this case, my username is admin, all lowercase, while my password is S631, all lowercase again. And I'll just, I'll put those in the description down below, uh, just in case you, you want a bit more clarity on those two. So this is going to let me into the web UI and the first screen I see here is my status screen and that has some information about my position and how my receiver's working, um, but for the point of this video, I don't actually need any of the information here. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to head over to the fourth tab there, the management tab, um, and I'm going to scroll to the bottom. And as you can see here at the bottom, I have four options. I have a format internal disk, a self-test, restore factory settings, and a reset. Uh, so I'm going to want to make sure that I hit the reset, the last option there, uh, and that's just going to perform uh, a reset on my receiver, which is essentially the equivalent of restarting your computer. I do not, I, again, I do not want to hit the restore factory settings as that uh, is going to completely erase all my settings in the receiver, uh, and you're going to have to uh, reset up everything, which is, which is always a bit of a hassle that you can avoid by just hitting the reset one uh, there at the bottom. So I'm going to hit OK. And you're going to hear your receiver beep once, and then it's going to turn off, uh, and then it will restart on its own. And once restarted, you're going to hear a beep, and then it'll go through the normal setup sequences, and you're ready to start using it again. And that is all for today's video. If you have any questions about anything you've seen in today's video, or anything you've seen on this channel, including the Hemisphere S631, or Field Genius, or anything along those lines, please give us a call at 1-888-286-3204 or visit our website at bench-mark.ca.